don't care about the others You set my world on fire You're my heart's desire I just wanna love you, just wanna hold you Just wanna be with you till we grow old Please tell me you'll stay Hello my sweet friends and welcome back to my channel. I am so glad that you guys are here. If this is your first time stopping by, then welcome. I would love for you to take a look around and join our YouTube family. Monkey and I thought it would be fun to bring you along for a little weekend day in the life. This is actually Saturday when I'm filming this. And first things first, we were like, we want a big breakfast. We haven't had one in quite some time. So we're gonna make some breakfast and then go run lots of errands and stop by the farm. Okay, so I went and got myself all ready after breakfast and y'all I have not made a big breakfast like that It feels like in such a long time. So it was so yummy and oh, I know you guys are gonna ask me about this poncho Um, hopefully you can see it but it came from Walmart I want to say it was like maybe $16 and if I can find the link for it I'll put it in my description box, but it's so warm and cozy and just like soft i love it i love a good poncho um anyway we are about to head to the farm we are i think gonna leave for the beach tomorrow so before we leave we want to go out to the farm and just like check on the rv make sure everything is okay there bunky feels like one of our tires on the rv was kind of like low in pressure or didn't have a lot of air in it the last time he was out there so we just want to go check on it and kind of put some air in that tire if it needs it and of course like say hello to my parents before we leave for the week so anyway that is what we're doing now i know we need to run by best buy and we'll probably just run a few more errands and then come back here probably make some lunch like a late lunch as we ate a late breakfast um and who knows what else but let's go ahead and head to the farm now this is why we're going to best buy funky and i got this new camera and we did lots Lots and lots of research and this one was like highly recommended um but there's just like so many things about it that i don't like and one of the biggest things for me is like when i press the record button it zooms in so far that i have to like completely redo the entire thing because like either i'm out of the picture or whatever i'm filming out of the picture so that was a big one to me and then also um the sound like if i'm standing behind the camera the sounds really weird if i'm standing in front of the camera it's amazing but like how i'm holding mine right now it would sound like really echoed so anyway we are going to best buy to return it i got all these accessories for it too but hopefully i'm going to get a new camera today i just got to figure out which one i'm going to get okay i have y'all propped up so hopefully it's like not going to fall but we went to lowe's and we returned what bunky needed to return and then we just went to best buy and i returned my camera i was going to get the g7x while i was in there but they were actually sold out and i'm kind of glad they were sold out because i wasn't like 100 percent about getting it and i still want to do like a little bit more research to figure out like exactly what camera I want. I know tons of my friends um, have the G7X and love it. And that's like what a lot of YouTubers use. Um, but I've also heard like good and bad things about it. So anyway, I just want to do my research so that I can pick out like the best camera possible. But anyway, Bunky is in UPS now. He actually got a pair of um, sunglasses for Christmas and they just do not fit his head. So he is in there sending those back right now. It's like our day of returns apparently. And we did decide to run all of our errands before we go to the farm. But this was our very last one. So he got that taken care of. And now we're going to head to the farm. Bunky? Yes. <laughs> Are you excited to see the bunk house? I'm so excited. Hopefully it's not going to be too, too muddy. That's one that you think is low? Oh no, no, no. 
Where is it? Over there. A lot of you have been asking when we're going to take the RV back out and we were planning a trip to Florida in January and then we decided to wait until February and then Bunky realized he couldn't take any time off in February because that's like their busy month. So I think now we're going to go in March, but that's like too far away. We got to have the bunkhouse out and about before then. So I think we're going to plan like a little weekend trip, maybe towards the end of January and then one weekend trip in February as well. So we're going to take it out. Don't you worry because we miss it so much. This is how this thing works because you know I don't really know. Oh gosh. So we're gonna find out together, my friends. Oh. <laughs> All right. Get a little bit of this available. And off of there. What are you thinking right I now? I think that that tire is like completely ruined. Like I think that there's like a hole in it. Yeah. Oh, there goes my little pressure gauge. Cause that's more than just like a little flat. Yeah. We're gonna have to buy a new tire. Uh -huh. That uh, let's see what that got us up to. <laughs> Not, not enough. Not enough, but... But he's going to take this back and fill it back up oh, and bring it over here. Wait a minute. That can't be right. What? What? Just the... I'm going to go get the other pressure gauge. There's no way that that's the right number. What's if it? it is, that's not good. That, that, there's a hole in that tire. I told you there is. So y'all, while we're out here, um, this is the pasture that we want to build in. That's like our goal and dream for this year. And I've always said since I was like a little girl that I wanted to build a house kind of like near this tree. I just think it's so pretty in this field. Um, so we'll like have the RV out here and then we'll have our house built. And that's my parents' house back there through the woods. You can probably see it a little bit. Um, and then down there is our lower pasture and our creek and the waterfall is right back here and you can hear it really well from where we are. So it's like very relaxing. You guys know we just love it out here so much. We are finally back home. We stayed at the farm for a lot longer than what we expected and we have not eaten since this morning. Bunky and I are both so hungry. But first things first, I'm gonna go upstairs and change really fast and pull my jammies and then I'll come back downstairs and we'll make some yummy dinner. Okay, way better and a lot more comfortable now to make our dinner. And tonight we're gonna have a spiced buffalo chicken breast with broccoli, mashed potatoes, and a honey drizzle. Does that not sound so good? And I do wanna thank HelloFresh for sponsoring today's video. You guys know we love Hello fresh so much and this time it worked out perfectly it arrived on our doorstep yesterday and we're actually leaving for the beach tomorrow so we're gonna take our other two meals down to the beach with us and we could not be more excited that we already have those planned prepared we don't have to worry about going to the grocery store and we got some really great recipes this time so we're gonna be taking a pub style shepherd's pie which I have never had shepherd's pie I know that's like such a shocker but Bunky loves it so we're really excited to make that one and then they also sent us like a pork flautas recipe which I think is gonna be so good but anyway let me flip you guys around and let's get started making this yummy dinner HelloFresh offers so many delicious recipes to choose from each week and that way it can kind of help you break out of your recipe rut. I know I always get so much inspiration from all of their recipes and I always get to try something new which is so much fun and tonight that Frank's Red Hot Seasoning Blend, oh my goodness, I am going to definitely be buying more of that. It was the perfect amount of spice. It was so yummy. Y'all, every single recipe is just absolutely mouth-watering. HelloFresh cuts out that stress of meal planning and prepping so you can just enjoy cooking and get dinner on the table in about 30 minutes or even 20 minutes if you choose their quick and easy options and that is something else I love about HelloFresh. I always know I'm going to get a delicious meal in no time at all. 
Okay, so to this melted butter, we're gonna add in some panko, some Monterey Jack cheese, and then the rest of our Frank's Red Hot seasoning, a little bit of salt and pepper, and then stir that together. This is what we're gonna put on our chicken. Y'all, it's gonna be so good. You can save up to 28% by using HelloFresh versus grocery store shopping and all of their pre-portioned ingredients means there's less prep and less wasted food and they are so flexible. They want it to fit you and your lifestyle so you can easily change your delivery days or food preferences or skip a week whenever you need. Okay, so our broccoli and chicken are going in the oven at 425 for about 18 to 22 minutes. Go to HelloFresh.com and use code 10 Jessica O to get 10 free meals, including free shipping. That is 10 free meals, including free shipping at HelloFresh.com using code 10 Jessica O. Okay, and as if this didn't already look amazing just by itself, I feel like we saved the best for last. So we're going to take our sour cream and... Um, Frank's mixture. We're going to drizzle this on top and then drizzle some honey as well. Y'all, this is going to be so good. <laughs> My friends, HelloFresh does it again because this meal is absolutely incredible. That little bit of heat and then like the sweetness from the honey and then the chicken has like that crunchy layer on there. It is so, so good and I think it's like paired so perfectly with the broccoli and mashed potatoes. I like love dipping my chicken in mashed potatoes. This is A++ as all of their meals always are. Good morning. I'm sure I have like some crazy hair and like some sleepy eyes. I just woke up. But um, I realized I like just left off last night after dinner. Monkey and I went and watched some TV and I totally just like stopped filming. But we are up and at them this morning. Well, we kind of slept in. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> But um, I'm about to make us some coffee. We have got to get packed so that we can leave for the beach today. So we have a lot to do. So I figured I'm just going to keep this thing rolling. And actually, I'm going to try and have it edited before we leave so that I can get it up for you guys this afternoon. So I have a lot to do. So handsome. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning, man. Okay, but he's up and at him finally. <laughs> Still wiping the sleep out of my eyes. <laughs> But he is headed back to the farm because he wants to do a few more things in the RV before we leave. Yeah. So he's going to rush, go to Walmart, pick up something he needs, mm -hmm. come to the farm. A couple of quick follow-ups after yesterday, but we're <laughs> going to get it done and then we're going to go... But you got to hurry because I think we need to leave in about three hours. I'm, I'm ready to head out the door, boo. Let's get it. So I need to steam this dress, but I just ordered it from Target a couple of days ago and I was so hoping that it would come in before we left and it did. It just got here yesterday and I think it's so pretty. I love the color of it um, and it's long so it should be like kind of warm as long as I wear it with a jacket. But y'all, how 
cute is this? And it came in like seven different patterns and colors. So I'll try and link it down below for y'all too. But I am definitely packing and taking this with me. Okay, y'all, so I'm going to go ahead and end this video here so we can finish getting the car loaded. I can edit this video and get it up for you guys today, but I love you so very much. Thank you for hanging out with us. As always, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button before you leave. If you're new around here, don't forget to give this one a thumbs up. I wanted to give you this little sneak peek of some home decor I've been working on, and I have lots more projects coming, so be on the lookout for those. I will be seeing you guys in the next one. I hope you have the best day ever. Love Love you. Talk to you guys later. Bye, y'all.